Hi, my name is George, and I just came back from Sri Lanka. I spent only five hours there, close to the airport, airport village and the airport. Why? Before my trip, I, I wanted to go to Sri Lanka for about five, seven days. I called the embassy in Washington, the Sri Lankan embassy in, in Washington. I asked all the details. Everything is open. You don't have to worry about anything. Just bring in a, a negative test for COVID, your vaccination, and uh, your visa. That's it. So I complied with everything, and I took my flight. Flew to Mexico City, Mexico City, Cancun, Cancun, Istanbul. And then I spent 16 hours at the airport in Istanbul to connect, and then flew over to... Uh, uh, to the Maldives, yeah, the Maldives, and then uh, Colombo, Sri Lanka. I landed, and then I found out that the, my car reservation, it wasn't there. Then I asked, well, you know, there's trains, there's buses. I found out that there's no buses, there's no trains, no transportation. Basically, Sri Lanka is on lockdown, but it's officially open. So I evaluated my pros and cons against, you know, if I was going to stay or not in uh, Sri Lanka. Unfortunately, without knowing, hotels open, restaurants open, no transportation of any kind. I took a tuk-tuk to get around and I decided to go back. So on the same aircraft I landed yesterday, the 7th of October 2021, the same aircraft I landed, I went back five hours later and I took my ba my 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 flight back to Istanbul, and here I am. There's Hagia Sophia right there. So here I am, all beat up because it took me two, three days to get there to beautiful Sri Lanka, and I did not see it. There's problems there. You guys gotta open up or or, or tell the world that you're close. I will be back. I will be going back one of these days, but not right now. Until you guys get to your act.